Hi guys! If you read the title, you know what's about to go down. Here's Caitlin. So today we decided to delve into TikTok <laughs> to react to some fuckboy videos. <laughs> like boy videos. I have some videos on my phone that I saved. Specifically, it's the questions girls ask guys, and we're just gonna look at some yeah douchebag responses. Ooh. But we're gonna start with this one. What's the first thing you notice in a girl? Her eyes. Her face. <laughs> Face? Her face? Wow, That's look at that so face. so general. Girl, your face? <laughs> the eye, mouse, nose, nostril, eyebrow combo. Oh, really oh. does it for me. Really got me going. That head shape. <laughs> How long does it take for a guy to start liking a girl? I don't know, five minutes. <laughs> That's a fucking lie. <laughs> five minutes? Five minutes. No, it takes five minutes for them to want to fuck them. I know that, like... To fall in love, it takes women like significantly longer than guys. Typically, <laughs> I don't know how accurate that is, but that is what I heard. What's a guy's biggest turn off? Uh, dumb. If she's like ghetto. <laughs> ghetto? What the hell is that supposed biggest to be? Biggest turn off is she's dumb. She's dumb. dumb. <laughs> she's dumb. She, she has an IQ lower than mine. Biggest turn off is she's ghetto. Who <laughs> uses that term anymore? Like, no. If someone wants to be ghetto, let them be ghetto. It's her ass. Ass. Damn it. Damn Sorry, it. I, I win this one. You do, I do not but, have an ass. But, you know, recently when I've been working out, though, I've been losing my ass. So I'm losing assets, but I'm also gaining abs. I have no ass, I don't know what So, that is. it's like a tit for tat. Apparently everyone likes asses, and I'm just here, over here with the flat Stanley ass. <laughs> we got my flat Stanley, Stanley ass. ass. Do you guys stalk girls' Instagram pages? Yeah. <laughs> they just said yes. They no. said yeah. I think they both said yeah. Do we like, stop guys too? I mean, well, I, I do. Well, I <laughs> don't. I'm never on Instagram. I just feel uncomfortable stalking anyone in any way, shape, or form. Like, res I respect your privacy, even if it's public information. I just feel weird about it, but I know a lot of people do that, and it's pretty normal. I just don't want them to kill me. That's why I do it. What's the most common thing that girls do that make a guy lose interest? Mm, talk too much. I was gonna say talk! I was gonna say he's gonna say talk! That's not a really a problem with me, I don't think. I talk too much. They would not like you, me. Damn it! You do talk a lot, talk but I much. love the fact that you talk a lot because I don't talk as much. I talk too much. If you have a very quiet man, it's a good vibe. But yeah. if you both talk too much, then that's a problem. Or if you both don't talk, that's just awkward. You just sit there and stare at that's each other. That's why I need, I need it like an extroverted man who will carry conversation because I'm an ex. Do side chicks know that they're side chicks? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Side chicks know they're side chicks. Not I feel always. like not all, but usually like if you're really aware enough to know you're being played, you will realize that you're a side chick. Yeah. But some people are just like very vulnerable and can get easily manipulated, and they might not realize. Yeah. Questions for the boys. Let's do it. Is it unattractive for a girl to be inexperienced? No. Ha! That's a lie. I think it depends. It depends, but like it... they don't want them to be too experienced because they don't want them to be a whore. That's not in my experience. I wasn't experienced, and then the, the dude's like, I want someone more experienced. Okay. And then like at the <laughs> same time, it's like if you're a virgin, that's like, oh, you're too innocent. It look, it's looked down upon. You know what I that's mean? That's so stupid. It's like, some guys are like so into it. They're like, oh my god, yes. <laughs> Like a virgin, yes. Honestly, if I was a dude and my girl was a virgin and I took her virginity, I would be proud. I'd be like, hell yeah, I took her virginity. Yeah. Do you guys like thick girls or slim girls? Both. Both? Of course you like both. Of course. Is being insecure a turn off? Yeah, sorry. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> But everyone's insecure. That's the thing. You can't just be like, oh, if you're insecure, you, it can't date you. I mean, there's a thing as being too insecure, which is understandable. And obviously that yeah. person would need to work on themselves at least a little bit to tolerate themselves. But, like, but we can all poke fun at ourselves and know our insecurities. Like, that's fine. But if it's too much, then it's obviously you shouldn't be in a relationship yeah because it's like you don't want the other person to solely be the reason why you have any sort of security at all yeah exactly it's just the way he answered he's like no i'm sorry like fuck off like i don't want to hear your whining ass first thing you notice in a girl teeth makeup. teeth like my teeth makeup or no makeup depends on the occasion depends on the occasion if we're fucking i want you to have full face of makeup yeah. are big cuties on a girl actually attractive as because long as it's like fine as long like as it's mine, mine. His titties? Big hoodies on a girl. Oh. Not big titties. <laughs> yeah, you, you just, you're just like, he's saying either he has big tits he or he has he's like, or he's just pointing out her boobs like, those are mine. 
if I wore a big hoodie to a guy's house, he shouldn't assume that like it was from another dude. Is that mine? It's not mine. Yeah, it's not mine. Oh, we're done. But at the same time, they complain that you don't give them back. Like, what the fuck is that about? It's like they want you to wear their hoodie, but then they're like, I want it back. You didn't give it back. Girls just steal my hoodies. Like. Bitch, you offered. And you could always ask for them back. Like, that's not rude. It is your property. Yeah. Piercings or tattoos more? Piercings. Yes, piercings. piercings. Like, what yeah. kind of piercings? I feel like this guy piercings. would be into, like, nose piercings. Yeah, he does. He like gives a... me, like, an edgy kind of vibe. Yeah. Like, he has a beanie. No, for period sex. The like, eye roll and then the smirk. I'm like, <laughs> I mean, I mean, to each their own. Like, I mean, it's not. <laughs> Something that girls think is attractive, but guys don't. Our butts. You think it's right? What? What? Their the butts. butts. So he's not an ass guy? Finally! What physical quality do most girls not have? What do you want me to say? What physical quality what do, you want do me to most say? girls not have? A dick? A dick. Does it sink or float? <laughs> well, depends, I guess. <laughs> Their dick. Biggest turn off. You. Biggest turn off. You. you. <laughs> What's the worst thing a girl can do on a date? Uh, <laughs> show up with her boyfriend. Yeah, that's worst true. Worst thing a girl show can do up with her boyfriend. Show up with her boyfriend. That's is, kind of funny. It's like, is that happened to you? Like, that are you okay? So what topics do you hate girls talking to you about? Their exes. Yeah, that's that's yeah. I would be pissed off if dudes started talking about his ex. I'd be like, I don't fucking care. Like, how do you know you like the girl? You just get a feeling. That's it. Yeah, I mean, there's no really yeah. other way. <laughs> just get a feeling. Uh. It's not the. It's kind of true. You just get a feeling. You're just like, oh, I like that person. The thing is, like, I, I get confused with my feelings. Like, I never know if I actually like like someone. Yeah. Or I just feel guilty. So I'm attached to them. Oh my god. I usually get more attached to someone once I hurt them, and that's a problem. Like, I'll push yeah. someone away, and I'll be like, I like you. <laughs> Wait. That's really unhealthy. I I need help. What's on PDA? The fuck is PDA? I know. <laughs> not know it. Public displays are they? They're fuck boys. They probably have no idea what PDA is because they're they're doing it behind closed doors. How long should you date before having sex? Should like, you date? Probably like two, few hours. hours. I was gonna say they're gonna say like literally right then and there. Like they just want to fuck. They, yeah. That just proves they're just they just want to fuck. Now it's time for the story. Okay. So I was on an app and I matched with this dude named William. Like he matched me and I'm like, hey, nothing. A month later, I'm like, I forgot I even matched with this dude. Now I'm like, oh, let's just try one time. I said, hi. He writes back, hey. And I just said, what's up? Never talk to me again. So then one day I downloaded TikTok because I was really bored and it was quarantine. On my For You page, I found him. So like, I made a video on him. I was saying like how like I saw this dude and like I, how I matched with him. Like I just told you I matched with him and he never answered. And then I tagged him in it because I'm like, you know what? This is kind of funny. So, and then he commented on my thing and he's like, left me on red. Like, he's making it so, like, I left him on red. I'm like, bitch, no, you left me on red. I went through his TikTok page and holy shit. Say we're on a first date, we both ordered the same thing, I finish all my food, you don't. Is that a turn off? No, more food for me. Is it that makes no sense. I don't that think was dumb. I don't think he was listening to the question. He wasn't, probably, because her question was if she ate all of her food and the guy <sighs> didn't. Is that a turn off? Then is that a turn off? But he still has the same amount of food regardless. Yeah. Is it considered unattractive if your girl can't cook? Because me personally, I'm afraid of the stove and the oven. Can always so. learn. Excuse me? Excuse you. How about go back to sleep and starve? <laughs> Go back to sleep and starve. What about you, sir? What you can cook too, bitch. You How come whenever I ask you a question on Snapchat, you just reply with a picture of your face? I don't know. Probably not interested. If you're not interested, don't even just delete them. Don't even respond. Don't even honestly, fucking respond. You know? That's why he didn't answer me. He wasn't interested. <laughs> He answered once and he's like, ah, oh, never mind. You don't want this slightly hotter Jim Halpert anyway. <laughs> How often do you and the boys talk about girls? <laughs> all the time. I'm all the time. Are you talking about girls all, all the, the time. time? How many I fucked? How many I've conquered? Conquered. How many have slain? <laughs> all I'm thinking is that Pippa Fireball song. It's like, I saw a came, a conquered horse, and I saw a conquered a came. Why don't you guys ever want to dance with us? 
<laughs> I do. When you Just guys not public, like a girl, do you? So if we're at a club and you want to dance with me, I'm going to so flat out say no. So <laughs> this man will not dance with you at your wedding? That's fucked. <laughs> he's going to stand there while you dance around him and he's probably like, babe, stop dancing. <laughs> no, I can't dance. I don't dance. I know you can. And lastly, what makes a girl special to you? Like if there was one quality that you notice and it makes a girl seem special to you, what is it? Being super sweet. Being super sweet. Hey babe, what's your favorite quality about me? <laughs> it's sweet. Well, if you're dating them, you're gonna best be hoping they're sweet. Yeah, you best I wanted to get your attention, but I didn't want to directly come up to you and shoot my shot. How could I get your attention? I know how not to get his attention. Dating apps. <laughs> <laughs> Do it me on TikTok. <laughs> he doesn't give any shit about any of these girls who are interested in him. Nope. He couldn't care less. He has an entire entourage of 14 year old girls chasing this man. Mm -hmm. And he's like, oh, get my attention, do it me on TikTok. No, you just want more TikTok clout. Yeah, exactly. It is. It has nothing to do with getting his attention. Nope. How can us girls tell if you guys are getting annoyed with us? Small talk. He said he could tell he's getting annoyed with you if he just talks oh. to you small talk. Oh, he only wrote one word to me. He was annoyed with me. <laughs> <laughs> small talk, hi. Small talk, hi. <laughs> Do you guys get annoyed or mad when we play little games with you? Depends on the game. Do you guys so if it's Uno, hell yeah. If it's Mousetrap, fuck off. <laughs> if it's Operation, if it's Operation, hell no. don't even talk to me. If it's Twister, oh yeah, oh, baby. Oh hell yeah, drug Twister, let's go. <laughs> and I'm sorry, but I gotta know. Tootie fruity, I like the booty. Tootie fruity, I like the booty. If any man ever said that phrase to me, I would run. Run. Anyway, guys, I hope you liked and enjoyed this video. <laughs> this was fun. <laughs> uh, we had a good time, as you could probably tell. I hope you learned about, you know, our perspectives on things and we don't mean to like call out anyone like anyone for being a dick but you know <laughs> it's bringing awareness to you if guys are saying these kind of small things like because a yeah. small dig can mean more later too yeah. you know but yeah anyway stay safe children be good people do amazing things and i'll see you next time <laughs> bye I was gonna say my virginity, and I was like, oh, that's not very protected anymore. But <laughs> I was like, oh. tries to grab their man's tits. Like, where, where are they? Where? Hello? Hello? Where are your negative A's? You have a new match, Beach. <laughs> <laughs> Let's make out no homo. <laughs> no homo. No homo. No homo. If you say no homo, if you it's, say, not, it's yeah. not gay. If he probably looks in the mirror and masturbates to himself. He probably gets off by looking at himself. He's like, oh yeah, she's so hot. And gay to yourself. Gay, it's not gay if it's yourself. It's not gay if it's yourself. <laughs> that needs to be on a t-shirt. Trademark. Mark. What if I literally made t-shirts and put them in the description?